Hi, this is Jennifer Faulkner, Training Coordinator here at QuiltWorks. In this video, I will be going over the HubSpot integration with QuiltWorks Web. Let's get started. I went ahead and created a quote and added some items. With QuiltWorks Web, there's no need to retype customer information that already exists in HubSpot. I will go to the Sold to Ship To tab in QuiltWorks Web. I will now click on the magnify glass. From this window, you can search by using these options here. I will search by the contact's last name. Once you found the desired contact, you will want to select Sold To, Ship To, or Bill To. This will send the contact to the corresponding fields in QuiltWorks Web. QuiltWorks Web also allows for you to select different contacts for the Ship To and Bill To sections. But for my example, I will be using the same contact for all sections, so I will select the option All. As you can see, the contact from HubSpot pulled into the fields into QuiltWorks Web. My quote is finished, so I am going to go ahead and save it. Here, you can choose what HubSpot integration option you would like to use. I am going to make sure both my options are selected. Once I click OK, we will be prompted to create or attach a new HubSpot deal. You can link this deal to an existing deal or create a new one. We can select a closing date, this stage, as well as any other notes you would like to add. I will now click OK to save. If I go to HubSpot, I, I can see the deal that was just created under the Activity tab. I can go ahead and click on this link here which will open up the deal in HubSpot. I can see things like the forecasted amount and the close date. Then under Attachments, we actually have a link that will open up the link in QuoteWorks. This allows you to open up the quote without having to actually launch QuoteWorks first. If I go back to QuoteWorks Web, we can go ahead and send this to the client. I will go ahead and click Deliver. I have a few different options for layouts, and if I needed more of a proposal, I could add a cover page, literature page, spec sheets, or any other documents they may want to include. QuiltWorks Web will take all of the documents and merge them into a PDF. You can also select a Word option to have QuiltWorks Web merge all of the quote information into a Microsoft Word document. I can either email the customer a PDF of the quote, or create an interactive customized web page of the quote with Quote Valet. For this example, I will use Quote Valet. Here, you can upload your quote to the cloud. Then, you can preview the web page of your quote before sending the link to your customer. Quote Valet gives your customer the ability to electronically sign and accept the quote, as well as make payment. Quote Valet will also notify you when your customer views the quote. I will now send an email to the customer with a link that will open up a web page to the interactive quote. An email record will be saved in HubSpot under the deal. We will view this in just a moment. Let's pretend the customer has accepted the quote. At this point, I would convert the quote to an order. I will go to File, then Convert to Order. When a quote is converted to an order, the existing deal in HubSpot automatically converts to one, eliminating the possibility of forgetting. We can switch to HubSpot to see the deal that was won. This will once again be under the Activity tab. Here is the email record in HubSpot. You can also view this under the Emails tab under the Deal, which will show you all emails previously sent for this specific deal. As you have seen, information has flown seamlessly between QuoteWorks Web and HubSpot. This integration will increase your productivity so you can spend more time selling and less time creating sales quotes. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact our tech support team at 407 248 1481 extension 3 or email support directly at support at quoteworks.com. Thank you for watching.